dug on in. Tweeted yeah. it out, all in honor of you. Well, thank you very much. <laughs> yes. And it's to remember because this is unusual for us. Not the snow part. You know, last December we didn't have snow uh, all month long as far as measurable snow. So that's not the unusual part. Last year on this date, we were at 35 degrees. Wow. That's normal. That's where we should be at this point. But when you're looking at temperatures in the upper 50s and 60s, you're like, yeah, I want to remember this. I want to remember this when it <laughs> drops down to 22 as a high temperature. So right now, just enjoy the moment, right? Temperatures at 43 as you head out the door. Winds out of the south at 7 miles per hour. That southerly wind, it's our friend, really helping us out uh, to move in that warmer air mass here. We have a few clouds this morning. I think we'll have a few clouds throughout the day, but I think we break into more in the way of afternoon sunshine. And that's why today is my pick of the week. The reason why today, uh, not only the afternoon sunshine that we'll see, not a lot, but just enough. Uh, also, because today is the only day that we have zero chance of rain, no rain in the forecast. We remain dry. So 43, a few clouds out there for you this morning. We'll have clouds at times, a mix of sun and clouds throughout the day. But I think by about 4 p.m., we go mostly cloudy and we keep that cloud cover locked in as we head into sunset. So it's going to be a great day. Now, as we plan it out hour by hour here, you start out at 42, a light jacket maybe needed this morning. Temperatures at 54 for your lunch hour. A great lunch hour if you want to head over to Monument Circle, donate a toy. Uh, most of us will be there kind of hanging out there. 58 degrees for you and comfortable as a high temperature for today. Upper 50s in the forecast for you today. That is great. That's fantastic. That's above the seasonal normal, which is set at 41. So, a long way away from that 40 degree mark. Temperatures tonight, they even stay above the seasonal daytime high temperatures in the 50s throughout the night. Uh, sunset happens at 521 this evening. Just another lovely night. Now the atmosphere will bring us a few changes starting tomorrow. You notice the forecast they model keeping us dry. I don't think we're dry all day. I think what's happening here is that the rain is so light that it doesn't measure too much. Temperatures in the upper 50s for you tomorrow as well. As you go throughout the day on your Friday, I want to show you what's happening because the clouds thicken throughout the day on Friday. We first see that cloud cover increasing across the area and then we'll start to see a chance of a scattered shower. I think mainly in the afternoon to evening hours. You can see overnight on Friday into Saturday that rain begins to move in here. As the rain moves in, we add to the rainfall totals, but not a lot. Lauren was asking this question yesterday. Will it rain all day on Saturday? The answer is absolutely not. It's going to be on and off. There's not a lot of rain to add up for us, but we have the chance of showers all weekend long. I think the best chance of showers that comes to us on Sunday, the more important thing that's happening here is the record-breaking temperatures that are possible on Friday and Saturday. Saturday, the record's at 63. I I think we'll easily hit 65. So temperatures are very, very warm. And as far as that cold front passing and dropping temperatures, it drops the temperatures, but down to the 50s. 50s are still above the seasonal normal. Daily chances of rain going forward here. Enjoy the dry air in place today. Lower.